Okay, here is another classic gun. This is the Colt Detective Special. And this is the third issue Colt Detective Special. This one was made in 1973. And I believe that is the first year for the third issue. Uh, the only real changes that they made in the gun was that they shortened up the grip frame a little bit on it and added an ejector shroud and the barrel may be a little bit heavier. Uh, this one is in 38 Special. Has nice nickel finish, nice condition. It's a uh, all Colts were uh, a six shot. I mean, I mean all of the Detective Specials were six shots. And they continued making this gun for quite a few years after uh, after that, I don't remember exactly when they were discontinued. They're beautiful workmanship on these old Colts. Now some of the early ones were uh, may have been chambered in uh, 32 New Police, which is the same as 32 Smith and Wesson Long. But the vast majority of of all detective specials were 38 special, just like this one. And of course the blue ones are a lot more common. The, I'm not sure just how, what percentage of uh, Colts were uh, made in nickel. I would guess uh, something on the order of uh, 15 to 20 percent of them probably were done in nickel. And they just did a beautiful job on uh, on uh, polishing and uh, doing the finish and nickel lasts really well as long as you take care of it and just like you'd expect from a Colt it's got a nice smooth action nice trigger And I just thought I'd uh, let you have a quick look at this one. One of these days I'm going to get uh, all the snub nose revolvers out and do a little shooting with them. I'm not a very good shot with the uh, snub nose revolvers. I don't shoot them enough to get good with them. And they are a lot more difficult to... Uh, to shoot than a, for me anyway than a longer barreled revolver or automatic but they are a lot of fun and these were a, a choice for concealed carry back in the day for police or anybody else and it uh, these grips feel good in the hand more so than the older ones. The older ones were longer but uh, a lot uh, thinner. And of course it's got the rampant colt there on the side. I don't know how well all these markings will show up. Try to get them on here if I can and get them focused in. And I guess we'll let it go with that.